Hello, welcome to Rita's Roost. I'm going to show you what I got the other day. Reckon where I've been and reckon what I got and reckon what I'm going to make or do with it. Do you want to see? I've been kind of tickled about it, so I wanted to show you. Well, first I got I got the pattern. Got it upside down. I, the pattern is uh, from Coriander Quill. I don't know if it's showing up or not. Is it? Is it going to be backwards? Maybe backwards. But it's called Joy Field, and I got the goodies to make it with, so I just want to show you. And I'm going to start on it pretty quick, because I've been cutting those bindings on them, too. I had started, and I almost got them. I got my fabric. Gonna go, gonna go with it. It's just colors, the same colors. It's, and this is Buttercup and Slade, so there'll be all them pieces for that. I've got my binding. I've got my got my backing. Let's see if you can see that. That's so pretty. Got my backing. I've got some for the border. And this piece would be the the some of the, some of the background. I don't know if you can see it, but it's got little white flowers on it. So I'm going to get started on that just pretty quick. <laughs> I don't know how long it'll take me to get it done, but there. There's my pattern. Kind of sampler blocks and stuff. But I'm going to show you another one because I ain't done. Oh, fall off my stool. <laughs> Y'all, well, that would be a blooper, wouldn't it? See me hit the floor. I got another one here. Because I told you I had a new grandbaby coming. And this is what I'm going to make. Got it up. Yeah, I've got it upside alphabet stars I'm gonna make that and I've got these panels here bought these panels with the alphabets on them I don't know which one I'm gonna start on first I don't want to start them both at the same time but it's got all the alphabet there and I've got these blocks th these layer cake squares that go with that to go to all different ones to make to make these stars around the, the alphabet blocks and I went ahead and I got the backing you see the backing it looks like a jigsaw puzzle so and well actually Actually, I got two of these panels with the ABCs because one of them, this will make a, this quilt is 63 and a half by 63 and a half. So I'm going to make one pretty good size. And then I'm going to make another one kind of small. I don't exactly know how I'm going to do it yet. There'll probably be enough of this, these, this layer cake to, to square them up and put them together. But anyway, I've got those these two projects, three projects to do. So what should I do first? Should I do this one first? Tell me, should I do this one first? Or should I do this one first? There's just too many hard decisions to make on which one I need to work on. But anyway, this, this one's gonna be so, so cute. And this one's going to be so, so pretty. And I, I about got those others hemmed. And so I won't feel guilty for starting more projects. <laughs> In fall and winters, so I'm almost here. The garden's almost done. So I just have lots of time to sew. If, if, if my grandbaby will let me. She takes up a lot of time. She likes to help me. The other day, I was trying to sew on that binding. And I thought, well, I can sit here and sew that binding while I watch her play. But every time I would sit down at the table where I had to had the quilt, she would come and bring a book. And I'd put her up in my lap and we'd read a book. So I didn't get much done. But then I learned that if I stood up and worked on that quilt, I didn't have to hold her and read to her. So I got it done. <laughs> Poor little child. She's not neglected. She's actually a little bit spoiled. She's a pretty good baby as long as you just let her play and run, she runs around and do her own thing. But
But anyway, I just wanted to show you what I've got, what I've got going. I've got more projects started. I'd be embarrassed to tell you how many started that I haven't done, but maybe I'll get them someday. It's all, it's all good. All right, that's it for me. I love y'all, and I'll keep you updated on this project. See if I get it done for spring. <laughs> Bye.